I took uh, Young Sport Jake out for a deer stalk with me. Uh, we've got to cull a few does before uh, the end of the season. Uh, I'm into the bucks on this estate. Uh, this is one of the co we had to do, and uh, well, when we stalked up Jake, there was quite a few, weren't we? Though? We did a full track all the way around, didn't we? Yep. And uh, we were just putting up all the different signs, and yep. we said there was more than one deer going through, didn't they? Yeah, all the tracks, and... and... You didn't see the deer, did you, right? No. You saw it like you thought I was going to shoot a squirrel that was running around. <laughs> <laughs> you saw the squirrel, didn't you? You saw the yeah. rabbit, you didn't see the deer, and, uh, but I seen them hiding behind the trees, and uh, well, we stopped with him nice and close, didn't we? And, uh, yeah. We're so close we can see the whites of their eyes. Yep. Good old Brandon did it again. The old edge creeper behind his butt. Hey, Jack Point Camo, they never saw us. And that deer never knew what hit it. Proper job. Oh, Jakey boy, there's deer number two. Hey, she came right out on the ride. Picked picked this one out of the three. They were there, and that was the cold one. I've got two more does earmarked on this piece. They've got to come out before uh, the end of the month, and then, uh, then we'll be concentrating on the bucks for the rest of the year. Yeah, it was a pretty good shot, huh? I'm quite... I can't aim too bad with a, with a rifle, am I? <laughs> anyway, on that note, uh, you better drag that one back. I'm going to drag it back by the high seat. Is he a little bit light? Is it a little bit light? <laughs> go on then, let's take it back and uh, we'll go and grow it and everything else. Alright, cheers mate. You just stalk deer traditionally today, and you see me stay and you see me take one from the high seat. Both pretty good shots, huh? Yeah. So, what do you think of your? What's well, your second time deer stalking in it? The first time we weren't successful. No. Nah. She was. She was. She did well the last time, didn't he? Yeah. We saw plenty of deer the last time. We just could didn't have a shot that was safe. So. Yeah, and they're mostly does, and we can't shoot does. Then uh, that was bucks. Then that season, when now we're into the. So this is the second time you've come deer stalk with me, and uh, well, this is the sort of tail end of the doe season. And that and it's sort of right there, three weeks, and uh, well, that'll be it. We into the bucks, and uh, well, we've got we've still got a couple left to cull on this piece, but uh, yeah. So you enjoyed your afternoon's deer stalking? Yep. Learned plenty? Yep. Well, you got the big job in a minute of uh, helping Grolicum. <laughs> Look at her face. It's carrying back. Well, that's all part and parcel of it, you know. Heavy deer. Yep. <laughs> anyway, what do we say? I pull one of the trees down. <laughs> well, they ain't light. You wait you got to do a red deer or a fallow or something like that. <laughs> and then you'll know you go. I keep forgetting you're a posh rich kid, aren't you? <laughs> anyway, on that note. Billionaire. Billionaire, that's right. Yeah. In, my uh, dreams. in your dreams, I know. Anyway, on that note, it's uh, the light's starting to come down and we've been pretty successful. Might hang on for a fox on last regs, because there is a couple of foxes getting around my birds here. I've seen a couple around the uh, around the pen, so might hang on for that, but uh, all in all. <laughs> Colin, yeah, it says, where is he? It's a school night. I know. Anyway, on that note, what do you say? Good job, Marco.